please use the raise hand feature to get in the queue. And let's start with uh, Austin Ward. Go ahead, Austin. Tommy, I don't know how how nervous you normally get for any game or a big game. Um, does it feel different at all for a playoff? And now that you're here, when might that set in if you have any nerves? Um, yeah, yeah I'm not really sure. Um, I'd say probably closer to the game. Um, but, um, you know, I'd say it's more, you know, excitement uh, to play. All right, we'll go next to Nathan Baird. Go ahead, Nathan. Tommy, just as you guys look at what Georgia does as a, a rushing attack, what stands out to you, why that's been so effective? Yeah, I think um, all around, um, I mean, they got a good O-line, good running back, and a good scheme. So I think when you when you put all those together, um, you know, you, you'll be pretty good. Next to Bill Rabinowitz. Uh, can you just speak specifically about the challenge of facing Georgia's tight ends? Obviously, it's more than one. It's Brock and, and Washington. How big a challenge is that? What do you guys have to do? Yeah, uh, they're good tight ends. Um, they they can pat and they, like they're uh, effective in the pass game, also in the run game too. Good as blockers. Um, so I think when it comes down to that, you know, everyone's got to do their job. Um, yeah. Thank you. Go next to Chip Towers. Go ahead, Chip. I mean, I just uh, I wonder what your familiarity is with Georgia. You got uh, you got any friends over there? Have you known much? Uh, were you recruited by them? And just kind of, uh, you know, what's your level of familiarity with your opponent? Mm -hmm. uh, you know, before playing them, uh, you know, no familiarity. I mean, I've seen them play, um, but obviously this past week studying them now, but. Um, you know, I, I don't, I don't know anyone that that's went there. Uh, you know, nothing really. <laughs> okay, thanks. Yeah. All right, we'll go to Spencer Holbrook next. Tommy, how important is it for you guys to keep a, a routine this week and and not get distracted by the other things that are going on? You know, the pre bowl process, the 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 events that they have planned for you guys. Obviously, you want to have some fun while you're down there, but but how important is it to stay locked in on what you guys need to do Saturday night to win? I think it's very important. Uh, you know, Coach Day was telling us, you know, we're on a bowl and, and things like that, but, you know, we're down here to play a game to beat Georgia. Um, and I think, you know, we got to do all these events and stuff, but it's, you know, we got one goal and it's, it's to beat Georgia. All right. Uh, back to Charles Odom. Tell me one more about the uh, Georgia run game. As you've uh, studied game film, um, Obviously, they they roll um, three, maybe four running backs. Do you see uh, anything distinguishable in in terms of their style, or do they seem to be um, the same kind of uh, the same kind of uh, physical and speed and same kind of mix of, of talents? Uh, I'd say um, you know just with running backs, um, you know, I'd say every running back kind of plays different. Um, you know, sees the game different, sees holes differently. Um, you know, some are faster than the others, but I'd say overall, you know, they're all they're all great running backs. Um, so all right. Next question from Tim May. Yeah, I got called out. Hey, uh, uh Tommy, when you look at uh, a couple of games, your last couple of games there, Tali uh, had a little bit of success scrambling, getting away from you guys, getting those little pickup yards. Obviously, JJ McCarthy kept drives alive with some scrambles, some uh, timely runs and stuff. What, what are sort of the lessons learned from those uh, two experiences? Because uh, clearly Stetson Bennett has that capability also, as he has shown uh, in a lot of big games. Yeah, I think um, just with quarterback run, quarterback scramble, um, you know, it comes down to doing our job. Um, you know, quarterback scramble can, you know, happen in pass and everyone's covered up and he scrambles, but, you know, the play is never over, right? So you got to keep going. Um, yeah. quarterback, quarterback run really comes down to doing your job. Um, and so that's what we're focusing on. All right. Tommy, I don't see any other questions in the queue, so you're all set, buddy.